Hey guys, Pamit here. Welcome to the first episode on my journey to going back and breaking five minutes in the mile. I'm 38 now. I haven't done this since I was 18, so 20 years. And I'm at a little bit different weight at this point. I'm around 225, whereas at the time I was probably 170 pounds. I'm excited. I'm excited to, to do it. I, I started off actually by just timing my mile and I ended up getting 632. So I probably should should focus more on breaking six. It's going to be difficult at times, and there's going to be some some discomfort. And I'm excited but nervous at the same time. I recently tried a little bit of yoga. You know, there might there's going to be new experiences, new new workouts, new ways of trying to get down to under the five minute mark. So I was using Map My Run to time it. It's an app on the phone. It's really good, but it's kind of tough because you have to constantly be looking at the phone. So I, I bought a uh, Garmin watch. It's great. You know, it beeps at the at the mile and everything. Here is my experience of trying to break six in the mile. Cue the intro. All right, so we did it in 6.15. That was uh, an improvement. This thing's great with the beep, it really is. So that was a fantastic experience. I'm so glad I said yes to that. I felt so much better this time around compared to the first time when I ran the 6.32. I, I had that kind of heavy wheezing. Like you could, like your chest was all kind of, I don't, I don't know how to describe it, and there was the blood taste. I want to find out what that is actually. I, you get it sometimes when you kind of exert yourself too much. I don't have that feeling at all right now, and actually my legs feel pretty decent, so again, so glad I said yes to that. I'm excited, we're getting there, we're getting a bit closer to that, uh, to that goal. So guys, continue to be safe, and say yes to something new.